Since 1975, Amano has visited tropical rainforests in Amazon, Bourne and West Africa, and pristine forests in Japan. Focusing on untouched nature with his trademark large format cameras, he was able to catch incredibly detailed images on extra large size films. His works have been exhibited internationally and Amano was previously working on recording the existing precious nature of Japan on film. He has advocated the importance of tree planting programs to protect the Earth's environment. In 1982, Amano founded Aqua Design Amano and the company attracted a lot of attention for its aquarium equipment nature aquarium goods featuring excellent quality and design. Aqua Design Amano offered an extensive premium range of aquarium scaping tools and Amano's passion for aquariums really came into perspective and his vast experience working in a dense rainforest, rivers and nature enabled him to introduce himself as a unique talent to the hobby. His work replicated and represented true nature and were geographically and perspectively correct and the results were truly striking. Amano soon became one of the most talked about and respected aquascapists in the industry. In 1992, Amano published his first photo book, Glass no Naka no Daishizen, followed by Missile Shizen Eno Kaikai in 1994. He used these books to display his photos of what Amano called the Nature Aquarium and it was translated into seven different languages. Over the following years, Amano went on to publish another 17 books and featured monthly in a Nature Aquarium section in Practical Fish Keeping Magazine in the UK and Tropical Fish Keeping Magazine in the US. In 2001, Amano commissioned his team at ADA to build a private aquarium in his own residence. This aquarium stood four meters long and one and a half meters tall and deep respectively and holds 4,100 liters. This colossal tank, although not Amano's own design, was inspired by his work and style ethics and the finishing product was simply stunning. Housing wild items, it became one of the most famous aquariums in the world and was a true credit to the work style and passion of Amano himself. Using only ADA equipment, the aquarium highlighted when you get into a mindset of Amano, you can achieve a truly stunning nature aquarium. In 2013, Work started on the largest nature aquarium in the world, in Portugal. Amano was commissioned to design and scape the aquarium. This aquarium stood 40 metres long, held 42,000 gallons of fresh water. The layout started on January 28th and finalised on February 2nd. Named Underwater Forest, the exhibit was Amano's biggest achievement in aquatic scaping and the resulting aquarium is one of the most stunning in the world. It is also the first and only of its kind to bear the Amano signature. On August the 4th 2015, the world received some very saddening news. Amano had passed away. Although not with us in person, his work and inspiration still lives with us. He was an incredible talent and a credit to the aquatic industry. Please share a moment with us to honour Amano and what he had achieved.